All right, so I woke up today to get the kids ready for school and found out that we got another trailer uh, for the full Wave 5. So we're going to... I haven't watched any of yet. Um, I just found the Direct. We are going to see what's actually going on here. I have Again, I haven't watched any of this, so we're doing a, a live reaction to, uh, to Wave 5. Let's see what we're going to get. I see Shy Guys. That's encouraging. Is that... I don't think that was Shy Guys, but a Koopa Cape. We actually got it? Oh my god. This is the one this is the one Wii track I actually wanted to see was Koopa Cape. We got LA! <laughs> LA is in is in Mario Kart, oh my god. And Moonview Highway. Damn, we got two Wii courses. Uh-oh. That's not good. <laughs> and we got a bathroom! Let's go! And Bear. I'm sorry, Bear, I had to steal that from you. With the with the with the uh, the showcase of all the new characters, Athens Dash. Nice. I can't <laughs> Daisy Cruiser. I can't look at this course without thinking of that map from Call of Duty. Headshots with red shells. Sunset Wild. That's what we got from Super Circuit. Interesting, interesting choice. And Vancouver Velocity. I think that's it, right? Was that all eight? Is that the whole trailer? And this is coming out when? It is coming out. Is there no release date? When are we getting the release date? Yes, we know. 48 courses by the end of 2023. <clears throat> when is it coming out? Just tell me. Wait, wave, wave five available. Oh, I got super confused. My, uh, my American brain. I had no idea what was going on there. Hold on. 12-7-2023. So what is that? That's July 12th? Is that right? This is UK. Is there an American version of this? I'll have to check. July 12th. Maybe it's the 13th. It might be the 13th in the States, actually, now that I think about it. All right. We are going to quickly check and see if there is a, uh, a separate, just to confirm that it is actually the 13th in the States. All right, this is a snapshot from the US, from like the Nintendo America version of this thing, and it's still saying uh, July 12th, but I think that might actually be, let's go check uh, the, the Japan website really quick. Anyway, it looks like the 12th. We'll, uh, we'll figure out what the actual release date and time is, and I will uh, update you all on Twitter to let you know when I'm gonna be playing, because I'm gonna be playing all day when it comes out, so either that's gonna be, uh, what is it, next, uh, next Wednesday or next Thursday, it looks like. So either way, I'm going to be taking that day off and I will be playing all day. But before we actually go, there's a few videos I want to take a look at because, um, again, this is the, um, yeah, nice. This is, uh, the, uh, the JP website and I'll put the link to this in this, uh, in the description of the video. And you can see that they actually have like gameplay footage and music for all the tracks. So let's actually just take a look and see if we can get more, uh, stupid Facebook announcements fan. Let's see if we can take, uh, get a, uh, a better look at some of these tracks. The music sounds very epic here. The, uh, the art style, not so much, but we're sort of belaboring the point. It's an interesting little setup. Daisy Cruiser up next. A very chill looking course this like that turn i don't know so far i'm getting kind of the sense that things are going to look pretty awful or they're going to feel pretty awful on 200 cc <laughs> looks fun though moonview highway this is one that i've heard a lot of people wanted to be in the booster course and okay hold on let's actually go back for a second here look at that they actually added it looks like its own unique car so one thing I complained about earlier on in the booster course pass is that a lot of the courses that had some of the cars, like you have the uh, the tour art style, but then you have these like realistic looking cars from Toad's Turnpike. And this is the, it seems like the first example of where they're actually trying to add something different, which is kind of cool. Um, but this, you know, like Shroom Ridge looks like it's going to be kind of a nightmare to navigate, but uh, we'll have to see when that comes out. No ultras available probably. We already kind of saw all the stuff from Squeaky Clean Sprint um, in the in the original trailer release, so not much to talk about here. I think it looks it's a very this is a very charming looking course, and it's it's funny that they use uh, again that they use all the the new characters in the in this footage as well. I like the music though, very chill, not very fitting of a bathroom, not enough squeaky noises in the uh, in the music there, but. 
And now we've got Los Angeles Laps. I think that's what it's called, right? I'm very excited to take you all through my old stomping grounds when we go through this course. I'll show you all the good places to eat. I don't see a lot of like stuff that looks very familiar to me though, to be honest. Let me, let's watch this again. It's like Los Angeles Laps. You would think they'd show that Ferris wheel that shows up like in every single LA themed game ever, like GTA 5. It just seems like a vaguely sort of beach town themed uh, theme track, which is okay, I guess. Sunset Wilds up next. It's, it looks like, like Mario Circuit 3, I guess, but in the desert. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not really feeling anything too special about this one, just from like my first glances at it. I mean, it looks okay. It doesn't look offensive or anything, but I don't know. Um, I would have preferred something else. Now, Koopa Cape. Oh, that's, so that's where the music came from. Uh, Koopa Cape, this track looks super interesting. This is like the one course I really wanted to play from Mario Kart Wii. Um, just based on how it looks in that game. I'm, you know, there's a lot of half pipe stuff and it looks like they're on these sort of on the inside. So you can see that it's kind of, uh, it's kind of curving in as you go on the half pipes, which looks pretty cool. Uh, and I think that's like, I prefer that sort of style, either that or straightaways. The half pipes that are on DK Summit, the where they kind of turn outwards are super jank, but that doesn't seem to be the case here. And Vancouver Velocity up next. Hold on. Team Ice Bros. I, uh, I like that. Very nice. I like how they start off with hockey there, but uh, it looks, this course reminds me a little bit of Mary Mountain, to be honest. It's like, it's like a cross between New York Minute and Mary Mountain. And so that is the full Wave 5 trailer. So I think my thoughts are, it's sort of a take it or leave it for me. Um, I, it, I was really down on Wave 4 when that one first came out, because I could just kind of tell that some of the tracks like DK Summit, I could tell were going to be kind of kind of annoying to navigate, but I don't see anything that's like looks super offensive like that here. Just from some of the things that we saw like in Daisy Cruiser, some of those courses look like they're gonna be really hard to play on 200 CC, but we'll have to we'll have to see how that goes when they come out. Um, otherwise, the music for a lot of these is, you know, par for the course at this point. There's all, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe music is always just like really good. Um, so I'm very, I'm really looking forward to that. It looks like, again, I don't know when the exact release date is going to be. It says July 12th, but I don't know if that's like July 12th JP time or July 12th here and et cetera, et cetera. But again, I will update that on Twitter and I'll, I'll be, when it comes out, I'll be playing all day. I'm gonna take the day off work and play all day. And if you wanna join in on that, uh, definitely make sure to subscribe to my channel and to hit the notification bell so that when I go live, you'll be notified and you can actually jump in because I do like playing with viewers and I try and make it a point to make sure that everybody gets a chance to play even if you don't have the DLC yet. So if you wanna do that, uh, make sure to, again, you know, like the video so that more people can be aware of this because again, I'll be my, the goal of my, my live streams on the day of release is to make sure to play with, with you. Uh, so yeah, looking forward to it. I am, uh, very excited again to play Koopa Cape. I think that's the one I'm most looking forward to playing. I thought when I saw the shy guys that it was going to be like a shy guy bizarre and I got very excited. So I'm a little bit, I'm probably being a little bit too down on sunset wilds just because of the fact that I thought it was going to be something else. But, um, you know, it'll probably be fine. I don't see anything there that's like very alarming. Uh, but yeah, I'm excited. And uh, let me know in the comments how, you are, how you're all feeling. What are the courses that you're most looking forward to playing? And uh, are you planning on joining my, uh, my stream? Let me know. And I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.